Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Doherty Dozen and this is my weekly grocery haul for my family of 14. Here is our dinner menu for this week that we made together as a family. For around the world night, we are doing Vietnam to celebrate their happy new year. And Friday is Bree's birthday. From there, I expanded to add in what we'll have for breakfast and lunch every day. And then I made our grocery list separated out by areas of the store. But first, uh, it's after 3 p.m. So I've moved on to sparkling water. I've got cherry pomegranate today. I just wanna say I'm sorry, we haven't been online much the past two weeks. Uh, two weeks ago, we were having some painting and wall repair done in our house. And last week we were having new windows put in, home repair took over the house. And uh, yeah, it was very loud in my house. I was unable to really make videos or go live or anything, but hopefully we are back to our normal routine this week. Let's go. After four weeks of rain every single day it's finally snowing I don't love snow but it's a nice break from rain one okay I just bought stuff at Costco I don't need dish soap I just need to get some of the kids snack bags because I stocked up on all of this recently actually I forgot to write it down but I'm out of my big long aluminum foil that I like we are doing around the world night Vietnam um, so I'm going to look for a few of these ingredients and look in the European, not European, but you know, the, I don't know, I call it around the world aisle, I have no idea. Okay, I'm sitting here scouring for coconut oil, I just remembered they keep it in the baking aisle here. Wow, look at all of these rices. Okay, I'm gonna go with this one. Okay, most of those snacks were made in Taiwan. Did not find any from Vietnam. I did order some on Amazon though. So, found coconut water that I need for a recipe. I gotta look up how much I need. Okay, so I'm gonna get two of these. I can't find coconut syrup. I'm gonna grab coconut soda. I feel like that would be a close substitute if I cannot find coconut syrup. Okay, and here is the coconut oil. Look at the cute Valentine's stuff. I gotta order the kids Valentine's for school. Okay, I was seeing if they had cookie crisp this week, and they do. So I'm gonna get two boxes. They've been out of stock like this. And we requested Reese's Buffs. Okay, I am not buying these, but this is the first time I've ever seen this product. Overnight oats, like pre-made. Because I have not perfected that. I see other people on Instagram have. I have not. Okay. This is one more spot I'm gonna look for the syrup. Okay, there's this. I'm gonna get this too. All right, we need sauce. I did not write that down, but we are all out. Here we go. Let's stock up. Some of the smooth marinara. I need 
need some for stuffed shells, I need some for lasagna, I need some for just whenever the kids want random pasta. And then I like to get the big things for making a pizza night. These. I wrote down diced tomatoes, but I actually don't need those or Rotel. I checked inventory before I left the house and we are good on both of those. All right, let's keep going. Oh yeah, let's get, um, actually wait, I checked inventory on those as well. I still had a big bag of can of oranges and a big can of peaches from the last time I went to Walmart. This trip might not take very long. Okay, I'm just gonna go grab the beef broth and stock. All right, this is for the taco soup on Tuesday. coffee beans right now and it smells amazing. I am good on coffee because I also grabbed that at Costco. Sometimes I make my list and then do inventory so I kind of wrote things that I don't actually need. This was one of those. I do need a bottle of water though. So I wrote things that I don't need and I didn't write things that I do need. I don't know. It's just this, this, this week I guess. Like, I did not write these Valentine Mill kebabs. But look at them, they're so cute. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Of course, there's 12. I mean, like, it's meant to be. I have to get it. Two. Also, gonna get some of these fun heart shaped brownies for sure. Food rewards this week. M&M's. Those will be perfect for Valentine Roll Bites. Wait! Do they not have cherry coke? Oh! There it is. It's just hiding. Okay, I'm also going to get some cherry 7-Up. I think I'm going to invent a new float this week. I mean, we do that every week, but like a new new one. I just remembered I need more Rolos for Rollo Bites because the kids ate them all. Seems to be a common occurrence in my house. Uh, shoot, are they all out? Yeah, I'm not seeing Rolos. Darn it. Okay, I am not finding Rolos. I'm gonna grab some Twizzlers while I'm in the candy aisle. Ooh, ding dongs. Yoink. I'm trying to figure out what section I can fit in this remaining part of the cart. Um, produce? Holy cow, look at that giant bag of popcorn. And I'm gonna walk past the toiletry section, so I'm gonna grab that stuff. My toothpaste again because the kids took it for the downstairs bathroom. And I want one up in my bathroom. And I also need my contact solution.
recipe. Good. 
aesthetically pleasing. Okay, I left that cart up front and we're gonna get another cart. Cart two. All right, I wanted to get some tissue paper for my Valentine's baskets. And I'm looking at these candles and I'm not in love with them. Returns 12 on Friday and I feel like this is just, these are boring. We need some more Brie appropriate candles. So we're gonna have to go to Party City this week. Brie is having a blue and purple mermaid themed birthday party on Friday. Um, I already ordered her cake. Aunt Kiki is already like well prepared for her blue and purple mermaid themed balloon circle. She's doing a balloon circle this time. Um, we usually do balloon art, but she's gonna try a circle this time. All right, let's go back to the milk. And creamer, oh my gosh, look how stocked they are in Torma Macchiato creamer. I like a little creamer with my coffee. Anyone else? those in Rochester, New York. I could be wrong. I'm going to search. But in case, we're just going to get some regular eggs. We've always talked about getting a pet duck. Oh, sorry. This week they are two for $14. I guess I'll just get two. Um, anyways, if you're new here, we have eight chickens. No ducks. Eight chickens, two dogs. My husband wants a pet skunk, a pet duck, and a pet hedgehog. Chobani flip or a big pack. All right, 
Alright, let me get some cinnamon rolls. This one's covered in frosting. Maybe I'm gonna just put that back. I don't want the frosting covered one all over my fridge. Okay, I need pizza crust for... Oh, what do I want? Thin crust or classic? Let's go with classic. Four breakfast pizzas this week. It said January 23rd, but it's the year 2023. Okay, okay. We're good. We're good. Let's get some bagels. of regularly going to Costco because it's making my weekly haul here at Wegmans a lot less in terms of carts. Cart three. All right, I'm gonna get Josh's breakfast sandwiches. I 
one half baguettes I actually did not check the freezer. I checked the pantry. I didn't check the freezer. Ah, I went right 
across pork. I gotta go back. Remember, I need dandruff shampoo. There we go. I love New York in the winter. Gosh, there's like no one here. This is amazing. Up. I'm trying to group everything like toiletries together, canned stuff together, snacks together, meats together. Makes putting it away faster. I'm just gonna leave those there. No dark out. Um, that took me two hours. I don't know why. Probably because I took too long looking at things. Um, but I'm leaving the carts over there by the side door and I'll drive over and load everything. And yes, I was super thirsty and bought another sparkling water and mixed berry. Okay, the parking lot was full when I got here and I parked way out here. No, there's like no one here. Okay, there's even like snow on the van. Alright. Drive on over. Load it on up. <laughs> Let's go home. Buckle up. This is not my normal shopping time daytime um josh is the track coach for our high school and they had a track meet today yes on a sunday so when they have a track meet they leave really early like i would not have had time in the morning to go otherwise i would have done that and then they got back mid-afternoon and i headed here so yeah, not my normal grocery time when my kids are texting me, where are you? When are you going to be home? Normally I prefer to grocery shop first thing in the morning before my kids even wake up. And then I get home like as they're waking up. Uh, yeah. 
back before the pandemic, our stores were open 24 hours. I would come at 3 a.m. Literally, I would grocery shop at 3, 4 a.m. It was wonderful. I was the only person in the store. I was home way before the kids woke up. Uh, now, then they stopped 24 hour grocery stores around here um, during quarantine. And now they open at 6 a.m. So the earliest I can start shopping is 6 a.m., which gets me home at 8.30 a.m. Which, I mean, on the weekends is around when most of my kids are waking up. So it works, but... I reminisce and miss my 3, 4 a.m. grocery shopping days. I was actually talking with one of the managers last week about it. I'm like, do you remember? Because she was always the manager when I would come at 3 a.m. I'm like, you remember I would come here at 3 a.m.? She's like, I remember. It was just me. Maybe someday they'll go back to 24 hour. I don't know. Anyways, what do we got going on this week? Bree's 12th birthday. Can't even believe it. Cannot believe it. She moved in when she was eight years old. Um, yeah. So yeah, I can't believe she's been with us nearly four years. Like that's crazy. And Bree's birthday party. Um, wrestling. Basket. The twins are in basketball. I actually haven't posted much about that. It's hard to get just the twins playing basketball and not like any other kids in the video. So I haven't posted much of their basketball, but they're really good. I mean, I'm their mom, so I don't know. maybe that's just like mom bias, but I think they're really good. I'm proud of them. Track. Wrestling. Deshaun has, oh gosh, what's it called? It's like a big, like big last wrestling tournament thing next weekend. So he's getting ready for that this week. But yeah, winter sports here are almost done. Uh, where's my hand sanitizer? Usually like right here and I can just grab it, but it's not there. Winter sports are almost done, and then we have a little bit of a break. We're gonna go on a vacation in February. And then outdoor spring sports will start. Uh, a lot of my teenagers will do outdoor track and field. The twins are gonna do flag football. The girls are gonna do horseback riding. And uh, the girls, I mean Zoe, Bree, and Harley. She made some friends there at the end, so we'll see. Um, who am I forgetting? Oh, baseball. Patrick plays baseball. By the way, Patrick is killing it at Nordic skiing. This is his first season ever doing it, and he got third place last week, second place this week amazing and um, yeah I don't do a sport <laughs> maybe I should I should work out or something that's my plan once we get our little workout studio thingy I want to get like a treadmill we used to have a treadmill one of the kids broke it for the football um <laughs> Once I get a treadmill, maybe I'll start exercising again. Get healthy. I'm trying to drink more water. It's like a foreign concept to me. I mean, I drink water, but it's infused with coffee beans. But I'm trying to drink just like straight water. And I drink a lot of sparkling water. ready 
for our February break vacation, but I don't really have too much to do because like I bought everything when we went to New York City. I bought us all the coats, I bought hats. I should probably get us some better gloves now that I think of it. Um, the little kids have boots. I honestly don't know if my teenagers have boots. They probably don't. Probably need to get them boots. I don't even know if I have boots anymore. I probably need boots. And let's see. Gloves, boots. I gotta check snow pants. The little kids have all this stuff already. It's just the teenagers and myself. But that should be it. Like everything else we have. driving there. I don't need to do plane tickets. It's seven hours away. Get home. Dinner. Baths. Bed. Baths. Book bed. The three B's. And here is the receipt for this week. Alright, got the water going. Oh, I'll put it away. If you want to just pile it here. Yeah. Thank you. I'm out here. I'm in the garage! What does that little Santa one want?
probably should go in that room. But they create the illusion that they're there. Did you notice how many pulled in? Yeah, I like that. I'm sorry, I was confused what lights you were talking about. Yeah, I like them. Okay. The bottled water. Huh? Did you get the bottled water? Yeah, so I put it on the shelf. Right there. Is this your toothpaste and yeah. contact solution?
what? Um, They'll be gone in a minute. Yeah, I guess here, these two are up to our room. You want me to take those? Yeah. 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 Okay, I have. what we have to do so our kids don't eat everything before we need a recipe or a special event. Thank you. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Let's put that there. inside this I'm gonna put inside Okay, well, we'll vacuum this tomorrow because I can't find the vacuum. But this is where most of our food storage is in the garage. We put up pantry shelves and then we have all of the produce, egg overflow there, the dairy overflow here. This is a stand up freezer for, you know, frozen stuff. And then this is where we put the meat and some dairy overflow, and clearly I got Applebee's last night. Yeah. 
random overflow. And this is where we pile up the laundry to go to the laundromat. Thank you for coming grocery shopping with me today. You are strong, you are beautiful, you are loved, you belong, and I am so proud of you. I'll see you next time.